I am here on a beautiful Seattle day. The sun is shining, the sky is blue, the birds are singing, and it is finally time to take you on the tour of the Fisherman's Terminal that I've been promising forever. So here we are, let's do it. Can't wait to show it to you. Fisherman's Terminal is located on Seattle's Salmon Bay and is considered part of the Magnolia or Interbay neighborhoods. The terminal has served as home port for the Puget Sound-based fishing fleet since it opened in 1914. You may have heard of the fish throwing shenanigans at Pike Place Market, but this is where the truly fresh fish can be found. On certain days, you can even buy salmon right off the boat. Fisherman's Terminal is home to my shop, Constellation & Co. We are a letterpress greeting card company and brick and mortar stationery and gift shop. Our antique printing presses, fun window displays, and unique items keep lots of hands and noses pressed up against our windows. We'd love to greet the public, so make sure you stop by if you're ever in town. This is just a little sneak peek. My next video will be a full shop tour. You can find many local restaurants and businesses at the terminal. I love to eat dinner at Chinooks, pick up fish to take home from Wild Salmon Seafood Market, eat biscuits and gravy at Bay Cafe, devour fish tacos from Little Chinooks, grab an Americano from the Fisherman's Green Market, and grab french fries and a milk stout for our weekly team meetings at the Highlander Public House. I made this video on a gorgeous sunny Seattle day as a shameless ploy to get you to come visit us whenever you're in town. This beautiful spot is the Fisherman's Memorial. Its centerpiece is a sculpture by Ronald Petty that was installed at Fisherman's Terminal in 1988. This towering sculpture and the bronze name plaques at its base have become a place of reverence, recognition, and healing for the families of more than 675 local commercial fishermen and women who have lost their lives pursuing their livelihood since the turn of the century. The Memorial Foundation helps provide safety training, counseling, scholarships, and more for the families of those who are lost at sea. The busiest day at the terminal each year is the day of the Fisherman's Fall Festival. The event celebrates the return of the North Pacific Fishing Fleet to the terminal. It also works to increase the public's knowledge of the importance of the fishing industry in Seattle. The festival provides families with a fun and educational outing on the waterfront as well as an opportunity to learn more about seafood. Proceeds from the activities within the festival are donated to the Seattle Fisherman's Memorial Foundation to assist families of fishers lost at sea. Many of the working fishing boats at Fisherman's Terminal spend months on the open sea off the coast of Alaska. A study from 2017 placed a value of over $545 million on the seafood products harvested by vessels that fish the waters extending from Oregon to the North Pacific and return to the freshwater moorage provided by the Lake Washington Ship Canal System. About 500 of those vessels are moored at the Fisherman's Terminal in their off seasons. Tenants at the terminal also include several small cruise ships, tugs and work boats, and other commercial vessels. Even a few of the boats from the Discovery Channel show Deadliest Catch call Fisherman's Terminal home. I am incredibly lucky to work here at the Fisherman's Terminal. This is where my shop is located and I get to take this walk every day when I'm working and need some time outside and I love it so very much. 
I feel very lucky for this to be a place that I get to call home. Thank you so much for joining me on this little walking tour of Fisherman's Terminal. It's a place that's really close to my heart and it was a pleasure to share it with you.